Hello, this is Reza Rad from Radicad. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can export uh, the audit log of Power BI, including all the activities um, as a CSV file without writing any scripts, any PowerShell codes, simply with just following few steps. Let's see how it works. If you don't know what the Power BI audit log is, it is um, logging all the activities that Power BI users are doing uh, with the objects in the service. Um, some of the activities, including uh, these that you see in this list, like viewing the report, downloading the Power BI file, uh, connecting to a Power BI data set, deleting it, changing it, updating an app, uh, publishing it, all, all the activities that is related to uh, Power BI objects in the service is considered as uh, as an activity that can be logged using Office 365. Now there are two ways that you can access this information. One is using Power BI admin portal audit log and access Office 365 admin center, which you'll get to a place like this. Then you can go and select all the activities you want. Like for example, you can say Power BI activities uh, and then choose the period which user you want to uh, search the activity for and then search and finally you can export it. However, there's a problem with this method and that is uh, this UI doesn't let you to download basically every activity. You have to limit the number of activities or the users or the date range so that you have just a very few records as a result and that then allow you to use it. So basically if you want full activity log, this is not going to help you. Another method which I explained in a video and a blog fully in details is using PowerShell scripts, which I have included those PowerShell scripts and how to run it uh, as well. But you have to run those scripts and you may not uh, like to use that method. Another method is use Power BI Helper. Power BI Helper is uh, an application that you can install um, in your desktop. It's a free application developed in uh, our team at Radicat. You can download it after downloading it. Um, make sure you go and register Power BI Helper for your tenant. This should be done only once. So if you have done it already, you don't need to do it again. The links to download the Power BI Helper, to explain how to register it, all of that is available down in my blog article. And after setting that up, you can open Power BI Helper from start menu and uh, this would be how the Power BI Helper would look like. Make sure that you have done the register uh, your account so that your service application ID is here. Um, the register in your tenant, I mean, as an app. Then you can log in with whatever account. This should be an account that should be either Power BI Administrator account or Office 365 Administrator so that it has access to, uh, to the audit log. Once you log in and make sure the login as admin is also checked, then this section is to export the audit log. It is pretty simple uh, setup. You just specify what is the start date and what is the end date, uh, which folder you want this extract to be exported and do you want the, the files to be zipped or not. It will generate one file per day. So zip would be probably better. The reason that it generates one file per day, one CSV file per day, is that those CSV files would be more manageable to open later on. Now, if I click on export audit log, it's exported. The export result looks like what you see here. Um, as you can see, I have a, a zip file exported, which I can click on it and it will show me all the CSV files. Then you can build a report from these. So without basically writing any line of code, using Power BI Helper, you can export the audit log as much as you want. It doesn't matter how big it is, and you don't need to write any code for that. Power BI Helper can help in a lot of other things as well, such as documentation, cleaning up your model, performance tuning. So go and check it out and let us know if you have any feedback. 
Thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We have weekly videos on Power BI. Thank you. Thank you.